Welcome to Minnesota, the state of hockey. Whether it's high school, college, pros, they love hockey here. Centers both set to dig on in, and we are about ready to go. The Panthers take possession here on the opening drive. We are underway. Handles the puck. Here's a short pass to Eric Sinek. Comes up with a stop. Oh, another great save right there. That's a slash on that play. The referee's all over it. Poked away in the neutral zone by Brogy. Let's see what the official makes for the final decision. The Wild have been penalized for slashing. And the man advantage unit comes out to go to work. Their first power play of the game. The game is scoreless, and now they'll start offensive zone faceoff, move the puck around, get it to the net, and try and impose your will on the other team. The Panthers have it behind the net. Moves it around along the half wall. Now a quick pass to Spurgeon. Moves the puck. Moves it to Verhage. Down the left wing, across into the offensive end. Play rolls on, and that's broken up. Takes it to the front. Oh, he got all of that. What a save by Fleury. Does it again with the stop. Erickson X up at the box. Both teams back to even strength as the power play comes up empty-handed, and we are still tied. That power play was a lot of window dressing. They had the puck in the offensive zone, but really didn't generate a whole lot. The penalty killers must be pretty happy with that. The transition game now into full effect as they move across the blue line. Streaking through center, they go on the attack. Here he is, takes the shot, answers it with an even better save. Works the puck across the line. Oh, what a save by Flurry! And the puck spooned away. Directs it on over to Kaprizov. Minnesota's got the puck along the wall. Gives them nothing in front. Those bang bang plays are just that. So quick. Puck on the stick, puck off the stick. The goalie's got to be in the right position or they're not going to make that quick save. Quick pass to Dumba. Picked up along the wall by Spurgeon. Florida's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Gaining momentum in the offensive end. Center into the middle. The shot. And that goes off someone in front and doesn't reach the net. There's the whistle. Let's get the call for the officials. Oh, he was mad at himself right away. You can see the frustration. He knows that's an interference penalty all day long. Minnesota's sending their power play unit out for the first time tonight. And if you're one of these power play guys, James, you can't wait now. It's your first opportunity of the night. You get out on the power play, you want to make a difference. The Wild have gained possession off the wall. Quick pass across to Foligno. Shot! Florida's got the puck shorthanded. The Wild have taken possession along the wall. Streaking into the attacking zone for the right. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. More time off the clock as they grab the puck. They gain possession here inside the neutral zone. Steps inside. Slides it back to the blue line. Power play has expired. And nobody's going to be very happy about that one, James. No real chances generated. No momentum game, just a couple of minutes roll off the clock. Can't make the connection on the pass. And he maintains possession of the puck here. Passes it to Stahl. Minnesota's got control of it now from their own end. Puck moved over to Hartman. And now a 
Chance grabbed by White. Down the right wing and into the offensive zone. The Wild have possession along the boards. And they'll battle for that loose puck along the boards. Takes a shot. 20 minutes in the books. Let's grab a breather and we'll come back with period number two in moments. Teams are back on the ice. Both squads gliding into position for the start of period number two. Still zeros on the board as we are now underway in the second. And with play underway, Razor, how do you see things so far tonight? The Panthers did just about everything well that first period, except they couldn't find anybody to score a goal. That's the viewpoint for the second period. See if they can take that possession and turn it into production. On the one-timer, denies him again. Tries to feed it over to Eric Sinek. Gets a piece of it to make the save. Tremendous pressure here in the offensive end. Shot, bad save. He's on it tonight. Grabbed along the board by Duclair. And he takes the pass. From the open ice, they gain the line. Florida's got the puck along the boards. Minnesota's trying to make something happen in the offensive side. Slides the puck ahead to Barkov. Picked up along the boards by Goudreau. The Panthers gain possession of the puck here in the offensive end. Both sides mixed up for that battle for the puck along the wall. The Panthers have it against the wall. Sends the pass in front, and that's stopped. Fleury's going to opt for the whistle and give everybody a chance to breathe. Sometimes you get running around if the shift gets wrong. This helps. Still a lot of time left in the period as we approach the midway mark. We've still got zeros on the board. Oh, and he takes possession of the puck from off the wing with the centers all locked up there off the draw. Florida's got control of the puck. Oh, and they probably want to redo on that. Quick feed to Reinhardt. Goes right to the crease. Scores! You can feel the tension here as nobody had scored up until this point. Everybody looking for the first goal, but really nobody wants to make the big mistake. Past the midway mark in this period, the Panthers have taken a 1-0 lead. Taken by Stahl. Thunderous collision along the wall. Dumba's got it in the defensive end. Carries the puck up through center. Poked away at center by Montour. Moves it quickly over to Hornquist. Oh, what a chance, and it goes sideways. A chance out front, and he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Bobrovsky's gonna give everyone a chance to breathe and hang on to the puck. And we're moments away from getting back underway here with the puck drop. The Panthers get a hold of the puck in their own end. Mahura stick handling in his own zone. And that's just out of reach. Here's a short pass to Hornquist. Tries to dangle and the puck skips away. I know what he's trying to do, get into space to shoot it, but now you got to chase because you've turned it over. Scores! And they go back to back to light the lamp. The momentum in the game changes fast. You get one, now you know you've got a leg up. You want to get another if you can. They get them quickly, and now they've really put them back on their heels. Florida's now jumped to a 2-0 lead as they make their way back to center. They're happy about hanging a donut on the other team, but the fact is, this second goal gives them lots of breathing room. Here's a chance! Goaltender gave him nothing as it goes off the side of the net. Nice feed. Makes the glove stop. Flurry's going to bounce on it, and he'll take the whistle. He's usually a pretty conservative goaltender anyway, and so the opportunity to kill the play, he's going to take it. Getting into the later stages of this period, Florida's really controlled the pace of play these last few... Scores! That's three unanswered now! Well, there seems to be no way to stop them. They got one, and it seemed like the momentum just changed so far in one team's favor. It's a snowball effect now. 
Florida's offensive performance is still in full effect here, even in the late stages of this period. They haven't taken their foot off the gas pedal yet. They are still pushing for more offense. The Panthers are in transition. Grabs control of it on the point. Denies him with a save. And it's kicked away. And now it's over to Addison. From the right wing, he moves it to the middle. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Feeds the puck to Forsling. And that'll bring an end to the second period of play. Let's get a clean sheet of ice and come back with the third period next. Alongside Ray Ferraro between the benches, I'm James Sabolski, ready to bring you period number three. It's been a total mismatch here as we get underway for the third. Let's see if anything changes. Ray Ferraro is back down at ice level. Ray, 40 minutes played so far. What's been your assessment of this tilt? Minnesota's got to get their boots dirty a little bit here. They haven't had the puck enough. It's like they're around the perimeter of the game, but not inside it. Go get it. Hold it. Drive it to the net. It's the way back into the game. Florida's got a hold of the puck. Moves it to Kaprizov. Hammers it on net. That seals over the net. And he's tripped up on the play. Referee's hand goes up here. Across the line and on the attack. And the play is whistled dead. Here's the call. Zuccarello's called for tripping. He's off to the box. Another scoring opportunity looms here. You gotta have a short memory on a power play. You haven't scored yet tonight, but that can't matter on this one. Get the puck back to the point, start moving it around and get people converging at the net. Along the right wall and into the offensive end. Florida's got a hold of it against the wall. And he takes the dish. Poked away and forces the turnover at center. Takes the feed in the middle of the ice. Greenway's crossed the line and is on the attack now. Last call here on this man advantage. Yeah, the power play's got to get the puck up the ice with a little bit of urgency. And now he angles it across to Hornquist. From the right side, he goes to the middle of the neutral zone. They don't score on the power play, but they accomplish a little bit here. They melt some time off the clock. They don't need the goal, but they don't want to make any big mistakes. And he coughs it up with the pass. Oh, he gets a blocker on it. What a stop by Bobrovsky. Inching closer to the midway mark of this period. The Panthers have dominated this one to this point. They lead it 3-0. Florida's got it in the defensive zone. And now he moves it to White. And that's stolen by Boudreau. He was locked in there. Oh, he reads the play really well to get out and aggressive to make that save. Florida's got a hold of it along the wall. Feeds it on over to Golodowski. Great defensive effort with the stick. And called for the offside. We'll get a face off. Past the halfway mark of this period, 3 0 is the score. The Panthers get a hold of the puck off the draw. Moves it to the offensive zone. Reads it perfectly, breaking up the play. Minnesota's got it along the wall. And that's broken up with a stick in front. Puck scooped up by Reinhardt. And a nice puck check inside the neutral zone. And they'll just dump it in and go for a line change. Quick pass to White. Now into the offensive zone from the right side. Oh, they couldn't connect on the play. Quick feed to Zuccarello. It's a contact sport, people. There's proof right there. The Wild have gained control of the puck along the wall. Glove save made by Bobrovsky. 
And the goalie covers up for the whistle. Just here in the late stages of this frame, the Panthers are in cruise control, leading it 3-0. Erickson X won the draw, and they'll look to set up. And that's blocked in traffic. Moves it quickly over to Kachuk. The Panthers played along the boards. Here's a short pass to Kachuk. That pass goes a little sideways. Great save by Fleury. And he slides it quickly to Mahura. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. Puck picked up by Kaprizov. Moves it to Eriksson Ek. We got a whistle offside the call. Defenders get a break here. That stoppage in play came just in the nick of time. They're gassed out there. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. Puck grab by Brodeen. Pass to Greenway. And the final seconds ticking away here in regulation. Gains the zone along the right wall. Makes a move and the puck hops away from him. The player's got great ability to hang in the play. Like that last one, James, he looked like after he stumbled, he was out of the play. Yet he gets himself back in position to get a pretty good chance on goal. There's the whistle. Let's see what the referee saw. I thought he was going to slow up somewhere along the way, but that's a charging penalty every time. along the boards. Hartman's into the offensive zone now on the attack. Here's a shot. The neck was off the player in front. And now it's grabbed by Felino. Well save and just enough of it. Bobrovsky's had a good seat for most of this offensive explosion. They're winning by a pile and he hasn't had much to do. It felt early that he was locked in on this one, and look at the final score, he was. Yeah, you make those first couple of saves in the way that he did, and it seems to just carry forward. What a terrific night for him. For Ray Ferraro, my name is James Sabalski. Thanks so much for joining us, everybody. Have a great night.